Alright, in this video, I'm going to show you how to do error handling in Swift 2.0. This is a new type of error handling. So, for the starter project, I have a, a credit card class. It's a basically simple template for a credit card. So, you know, each credit card has a credit card, a hard credit card limit. That's why it's a constant let. There is, it's, this will not change. So, it's a hard credit card limit. Then the balance is uh, variable because it keeps it may change with the purchase. Then uh, I have purchase function where I take it takes in a purchase amount, and if the credit card balance plus purchase amount is greater than credit card limit, then uh, it throws a fatal error and everything stops. The program uh, quits and everything freezes. So uh, this is the that's the fatal error, and this is the message for the fatal error. Or else, if the uh, credit card balance plus the purchase amount is uh, equal to credit card limit, or if it's less than credit card limit, then the purchase goes through, and I'm simply going to print out uh, what are the new balances. And so, from this credit card template, I have created a Mastercard instance. So I have created a specific uh, uh, Mastercard, and then I have uh, made a purchase for let's say nine hundred dollars. So and then so it prints out the balance. So my current balance, the previous was zero. Now my current balance is nine hundred dollars, and I'm I'm again printing out here, printing out here, what my credit card balance is. So here, if I were to instead of nine hundred, if I add a zero and make it nine thousand, then it should it should throw a see through the see execution was interrupted. Throws a big error. Everything stops, and you can uh, use the you have to quit the app. So let's go back to 900. So this part is working fine. Now we're gonna start adding the new error type. So in new error type, uh, in in the new Swift 2.0, you have option to create uh, error types. So for specific uh, types of uh, error, you can assign it to a error type so let's do that first so I'm going to create enum reddit card error is a type of error type uh, case uh, exceeded credit card limit Again, uh, you can create multiple cases here, of uh, but we only have one function and we have a pretty simple uh, app, so I'm going to create only one uh, credit card error type. So okay, so now I'm going to comment out the fatal error thing. Now in here, I'm going to throw the error. So if the credit card balance exceeds the credit card limit. I'm going to throw credit card error dot exceeded credit card limit. Now we get an error here. Why the error is not handled because the enclosing function is not declared throws. So this function should be declared as throws. So here I'm going to write throws and that will take care of this error. Now we get an error here again. So whether you can, so this uh, purchase method call can throw, but is not not marked with try. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to run this in a do loop. So do loop is uh, nothing but a while loop, but it only run runs once. So I'm going to mark this with try and then I'm gonna put this inside the do loop and then I'm gonna catch so if this throws an error then I'm gonna catch it and I'm gonna check for a credit card error type actually I need to copy that error dot exceed credit card limit if it's exceed then I'm gonna print uh, could not make the purchase 
okay and then uh, yeah then so let's test test it out whether it's working now now the now there is no error we don't see no error okay so so it, first we made a purchase of $900 and it's showing the current balance is $900 and your balance is $900 if I were to instead of 900 I make it 9000 now as you can see here it is throwing this uh, particular error and this code is executing and in the console you can see could not make this purchase so so as you can see it's pretty simple the error handling in swift 2.0 swift is very easy you just have to throw the error and then you have to try the function in the do loop and then catch that particular error okay so your challenge for this video is to pass uh, the amount so what is the difference so if let's say uh, is I'm trying to make 9,000 purchase so that means I'm exceeding my credit card limit by $8,000 so that particular information I want you to pass from here to here and print it out over here so that way the user would know how much but I'm exceeding my credit card limit by what amount so that's uh, challenge number one and the challenge number two is to uh, basically what uh, you, what you what I want to teach you is passing the instead of handling or error over here you can propagate error to another function and handle it over there so for that in here you can create a temporary credit card and then uh, then pass the error to the next function so the solution for the challenge is available on my website so if you're watching this on the YouTube then click on the link in the description box and that will take you to my blog and if you sign up there then uh, you will get the solution for uh, all these challenges and the uh, uh, playground file for uh, this and solution uh, solution for the challenge and if you're already on my block then just you know go down and uh, sign up and you'll get the solution delivered right in your inbox all right thanks for watching